going on for five to six thousand years. It is the war between the Thunder God and the Great Mother. It is the war between the patriarchal religions who believe that they could do it better than the Great Mother. But all we got to do is look at the condition of the planet and we know that patriarchy does not work. All these goddamn wars on the planet, all this men competition on the planet, women being subjugated on the planet, it does not work. In order for us to save this planet, we have to go back to a loving and kind God. But Father God is not that loving and kind because if you break your promise, your ass is going straight to hell. Mm. And that is not what the great mother taught. We're going to find out what hell is today. So, there was a mystery about the Egyptian goddess Isis. All other Egyptian deities like Ra, Horus, Nuke are known by the Egyptian names, but Isis is always referred to by only a Greek translation. A clue to this mystery is that the Egyptian name of the goddess Isis was also as Set. So in Hebrew, Osiris, Isis, and, and Horus. We get that story. There were stories older than that. And we're going to find out a little bit more about that. Let's go into that. Okay. When she ruled alone. When she ruled alone. And was seen as the creatrix. Then she had a son called Osiris. Most times we only hear the story where Osiris is her husband. But we never even hear the story about when Isis was the mother of Osiris. Okay. Okay. Those names mean in the ancient Egyptian son of Isis. In the Egyptian son of Aset. In time, Osiris became Isis' brother and then her husband. When he became her husband, Isis had another son called Horus. Though in his original form, he was lame and deformed because he was only born of a mother and was without a father. Horus also had a twin brother called Set, or Sut, from which the word Satan comes from. He was the evil brother that opposes Horus and was responsible for murdering Osiris. In later versions of the story, he cut up Osiris into 14 pieces. But then Osiris was brought back to life by Isis and became Horus. In other versions of the story, Set was Osiris' brother, and Osiris fathered Horus. Yet Set, as it turned out, was an older god than either Osiris and Horus. Set was older than both of them. Okay? And he was once a benevolent god. A benevolent god. Set in the Egyptian also means queen, princess. Ah, set means exceeding queen. So it seems that set was once the goddess Isis. Okay? And when you look at this photograph, what you see is the goddess Aset, and you see this small boy by the name of Asal. Can you see that? Is it clear? Is it clear? Yep. They never show this photograph here. You always see Asal as a grown man, but you never seen him as a little boy. You always see Horace as a little boy. So this gives us an indication that the story is correct. And real. The original so Egypt or Kemet goes further than Kemet because we got to start in Kush. So Tarseti, meaning at the foot of the mountain or the origin of where our ancestors began to do this wonderful work in the Nile Valley. So the, the land of Seta, right, was Tarseti, right, in the Egyptian language. Ta meaning land and Seti, you know the name, you know the deal. So then Set became both male and female with the feminine version as being Aset or Isis in the Greek translation the male set was then known as a benevolent serpent god who would die and be reborn in the womb of the mother goddess, Aset. Lord Osiris took his place. So a new story was created in this version as 
I said, or Isis would swallow Osiris whole, and then he would be reborn from her as the god Horus. Then in later versions of the same story, it was the male god Set who murdered Osiris and cut him into 14, into many pieces, and he became, and it was the female Set. So not wanting to cause trouble with the followers of Isis, the Egyptian name of Isis had to be censored in Europe. Still to this day, they reverence the goddess Aset in Europe. The word Paris, Paris. A lot of us want to save our money and go to Paris. We want to go to Paris instead of going over here. But Paris is the house of Isis. The word Paul means house and Is is short for Isis. So in Europe to this day, they are still worshiping the great black African mother. When the Pope ass got shot, he did not go downstairs and pray to Jesus. He went downstairs and prayed to the Black Madonna, who is none other than the Black Goddess Aset. Not only that, most people don't know that Africans built Rome. It was the Africans that was in Rome first. It was the Africans that was in Greek first. It was the Africans that was in every geological location on the planet Earth. And so what you think is European mythology. What you think is Greek and Roman mythology is none other than African mythology whitewashed. There is no such thing as Greek mythology, as our dear brother George G.M. James pointed out. There's no such thing. So the early Greeks were African matriarchs who left Egypt, they went down into Libya, they went down into Argo, the Grecian Islands, they went down into Asia Minor, they went into Canaan, they were the Philistine or the, the Phoenicians. The original Hebrews, the black Hebrews that were down there originally were worshippers of the great black mother Aset, who they called 